Hello, Sim family. My name is Carrie Jessica. Welcome to my channel. I am your friendly neighborhood silver haired simmer. I'm the mom in the neighborhood that spends as much, if not more, screen time than the kids, and today is no exception. Why was that so hard to say? Okay, so today I'm gonna hop into Cass. I have been really wanting to just have like a low key Cass and chill kind of moment. Um, so I'm hoping that you will hang out with me while I give a few Sims a base a few base sims and makeover to add into my not so very let's play my intent is to have the sim be um in the world for aiden to meet maybe they will be in the politician career as well so i did get permission from a couple of simmers over on twitter this is kind of a trend that's happening on Twitter where people are making a base sim and allowing people to make them over. So I did get permission from all of these people specifically for not only to give them a makeover, but to do this on YouTube. So the very first one that I'm going to do is from Aiden on Twitter. I will try to link their Twitter um, in the description box below, but it's A-Y-D-A-N. And on the gallery, you can find them under Simplice Sims. So this is our very first gal and I am going to place her in household. We're going to replace the random cast person that's here. Oh, she is so cute. And she is active and cheerful and creative. And she wants to be a bodybuilder. Like it. Like it a lot. These next two sim you can find on the gallery under Frosty Breakfast. And if you want to follow them over on Twitter, it's Ice Cream for Breakfast, which, hello, very into. Okay, so we have a female and a male base sim. So let's go ahead and add them both. Oh, no, I didn't mean to add it to my library. I mean, I will be adding them to my library, but I didn't mean to do that at this second. Let's place them. We want to merge them into this household. And let's see, this Sim is a recycled disciple and jealous and family oriented. Let's hop back into the gallery. And this, I'm just looking at my phone to make sure that I have the right Sim that they said that I could do this for. <laughs> All right, so this Sim is creative and family oriented and good. These will be some great political influences for Aiden to have his friends. Um, this one wants to be a musical genius and is a muser, okay. And then the last one that we're going to do today is from Artha Bizus. Okay, so let's merge this one. So this is Julia. Julia is creative, good, and materialistic. And this is Sheila, and Sheila is a child of the island and family oriented and an insider and they want to be a master actress so maybe this will be the one person in the household that is not kind of in line with everyone else they want to do something different this is yasmin yasmin is beautiful okay so the first thing i'm going to do is go into skin details and kind of use <laughs> the ones that I like. <laughs> I would like for these sim to look a little different than when I just jump into cast and start making sims because because I always tend to make them look the same way that I make them look. I use the same my favorite skin details and all of that kind of over and over. Um, I really like this and I don't think I use the skin detail too often. Oh that's sweet. Okay, so I think I'm going to use this Obscurus Skin N4. So these I've been using so much lately, but because you can only add one thing in each category, I have not been doing anything else in this category because I've been constantly adding these like natural blush overlays and I really like them a lot. Um, and these are the Boo Boo Blush. I, I think that they add a, a nice dimension, like well rounds your sim. And I do like this body highlight. I feel like it just adds a little bit of like natural look to their skin and I am here for it. Okay, so now I'm gonna go into tattoos because I think that there's a few other body things that I like to put in the mix. Let's do the face. And again, it's just a little bit of pores. It's a little bit of dimension. You know, I don't think it's sitting well with these freckles though. So I'm gonna take those off. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot, but I feel like one arm would be better. Okay, yeah, that's very cool. All right, let's do that. Okay, so now we can give her some alpha eyebrows because I prefer alpha things. Oh, what do we think? Do we just kind of keep her straight and more of like a, a medium longer? I, I think I like that. Let's make sure it's carried over to all of their... Perfect. Okay. If she ends up like in our story more, I will go through and make sure I add accessories and makeup to all of the outfits. But for right now, I'm just going to focus on their like everyday look. 
Let's give her a little bit of a soft makeup look. This is the makeup set from Go Paws Me CC26, I believe is what it says. My eyes are not great even with my glasses on. Okay, I think that's perfect. That's the Go Paws Me makeup set CC37. I think that looks kind of perfect. All right, I don't really think I'm gonna go too heavy with eye makeup on her. All right, so here we have Yasmin Salas. Um, and I think that she is very, very pretty. Um, hopefully Aiden will meet her and like her. I don't know why I zoomed in so close to her face. That was kind of weird. Um, all right. So here we have our very first new Sim to add into our Not So Berry Let's Play. Right, next up, we have Anna Liu and she is the Jealous Recycled Disciple who's also a family oriented. All right. Let's again, trying to go in and use different things and what I always use. All right, so this, it doesn't change too much of the way her face is shaped and I really like that. Okay, wait, that does. That does not. Okay, that's what we're going with. Okay, so let's give her a soft lash. Again, I just love that boo boo blush. I feel like that just goes on all of my Sims. No question. All of them get it. <laughs> I'm kind of feeling a short hair moment for her, but I don't have a specific hair in mind. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. Kind of that like messy, longer pixie. I, I, I like that a lot. And I don't use these hairs very often. They're from Mood, M-O-O-O-D, I want to say is, is the creator. And I love them so much, but sometimes they just don't sit right on some of my Sims, but this, ugh, it, it looks really good. I think I'm going to stick with it. Okay. Sometimes mine likes to just give random different hair colors throughout. Okay, so I'm gonna stick with a, guess what? I'm gonna stick with a softer makeup look because I feel like that's all I ever say. Yeah, I kind of like that. I think that's a very cool look for her. Let's give her some accessories. She's gonna have some cool nails. Oh, we have the new Frenchie nails, which by the way, my nails are Frenchie right now. It could be because I'm celebrating this new pack. It could also be because my nail tech took my hand after I asked for an American manicure with no real like art decal and he took my hand so lovingly in his and said no we do French and a snowflake <laughs> so I have French nails with a snowflake <laughs> I think I'm just gonna go black that's kind of my go-to. Okay, and then our only guy in the mix is Dion, Dion Rosales, and he is creative, family-oriented, and good. Love that for him. Okay, so of all of them I've tried on, I think that I like this um, Rasmussen. I, I don't remember how to say the creator's name, but um, but I have, I got it from The Sims Resource and this one is number 11 and I think I like it the most. Um, I really like those. Okay, let's get some clothes on our mans here. So he is good, creative, and family oriented and he is a musical genius. Okay, I might be saving Dion for a future gen because I think that I just fell in love with him. <laughs> Whoops. All right, next up, we have Julia Vasquez. She's materialistic. She is good and she is creative and she wants to be a best-selling author. Love that for her. She's very, very cute. I think I'm gonna stick with that. Okay, I like that. Ooh, I like those. I like those a lot. Let me lighten up her eyebrows some. And maybe she is, maybe she's a politician who's writing on the side, very much in line with what Aiden is also doing. Like. Um, that can be a whole moment. I, these Sims, I love them. They're, I, I am falling in love with all of these Sims. Okay, I think Julia is done. I'm actually gonna give her her makeup on this outfit just because this is probably my favorite. By far, not probably, this is my favorite. 
All right, so there we have Julia Vasquez, and then our last sim is Sheila Madison, and Sheila is a child of the island. She's family-oriented, and she is an insider and wants to be a master actress. I think that's pretty good. Mm, she's so stunning. Should we do a little, like, peekaboo tooth? Oh, that's cute. That's very cute. Okay, we'll do that. She's almost too pretty. Like, she's the kind of pretty that, like, makes other people afraid to speak. <laughs> so she wants to be this, like, big celebrity actress. I feel like her eyebrows would be super important, you know? Like, I don't want to mess up the eyebrows for her. These could work. I love them. They're nice and full. Okay, we're going to give her these eyebrows. Um, yeah, okay. <laughs> she's really pretty. All right, hair. I'd like to use a hair that I don't use often because I feel like I've been in a habit of using the same hair over and over even though I have a million different hair. Hairs. Hair. And I don't think I've ever used it and it's really pretty. This is from S Club and I found, I find their stuff on The Sims Resource. That's kind of cool. Okay, let me do her makeup. She's too put together for my liking. I don't think I can handle her. All right, and she is definitely gonna have like a full glam eye, which I don't even, she, again, she's like too intimidating for me to even try to like put her together. Like I could never. Um, I am gonna go ahead and make a couple other sim that I'm just gonna make real quick. Let's see, we have, whoops, we have three, four, five in this household, so we can add a couple more. So I am going to um, just make a couple more for Aiden on my own. Let's just randomize a bit and see where we get for a starting point. All right, and then let's take off everything and kind of start fresh. You know what, since I'm kind of making things, like making Sims for Aiden specifically, I am going to maybe give him a romantic, something that's really kind of matches him almost a little bit too well, because he needs a few failed relationships. Uh, maybe we'll make her a bookworm and a foodie. I feel like those all align up for him and just to kind of give Aiden a run for his money. She's gonna be a serial romantic. What's her name? All right, let's get some skin details on her. We've already got the body shine. Let's check out Hannah. Um, that's almost a little too flat for what I tend to go for. Um, I don't know what this one is. It doesn't have a name on it, but I do like it. Yeah, that's really cute. I think I'm gonna use that. I don't think I've used it before, or if I have, I have it. It's not one that I usually go to. Okay, I really like a little bit more prominent ear sometimes, so we'll do that. I love being in Create a Sim. <laughs> it's my favorite place to be. All right, she's good. Let's get some hair on our lovely, lovely lady here. And I feel like I would like for her to have glasses. Um, obviously I love glasses. I don't know. I don't really love them on her though. Now that I'm like sitting here with them. I don't know. I don't like them. She's not a glasses girl after all. All right. I feel like I have put on every lipstick that I have just to end up with a lip gloss that I feel like I use all of the time. Okay, and for our bookish serial romantic, let's give her a bit of a casual, cozy vibe. Okay, I like that. Oh, <laughs> I love the top hat moment. Like that's, that's something. All right, she's super cute. I could see her being a potential love interest for Aiden. And let's give him a, another guy to possibly be like buddy pal that he hangs out with at work. This is it, this is our work buddy. Okay, let's take everything off and we will start over with him. Do we like that? This is when I wish that I could stream so that I could like actually converse. Where did I, okay, I'm starting over. 
Making male sim is so much harder for me to do than female sims. I think a lot of people feel that way. I don't know if it's just that there's not as many options or I just don't know where to go with those options. Okay, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Okay, so he is going to be a friend of Aiden's. He is going to be a geek foodie who is also, he's self-absorbed and he is going to want to be rich. <laughs> What's his name? His name is Brett Cutler. That is who he is. Okay, so I am going to I'm going to call this the interns. These are all going to be a profession, working professionals just starting their career out. All right, guys, I'm going to end this one here. I am going to hop in and I'm going to give them all jobs and things like that so that the interns are all starting their careers and different jobs. Uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me. This one's going to be kind of a beast to edit because, of course, I like zoned out for so much of it. But um, if you're still here, thank you. Go ahead and hit that like button and drop a comment. Believe it or not, those things help my channel and I greatly appreciate it. If you have not yet, hit subscribe so you can hang out with me more often. Often. And if you want to find me in other places on the internet, I will put the links to the other socials in the description box below. Um, and and I think I'm about to play some Not So Berry. Um, Ada needs to start his career out. So that video will be coming in just a couple of days. I will see you then. Bye, guys.